talking about sex with kids. Nah, that's a no-no. Man never grew up like that. <laughs> yeah? No, that was a taboo subject. Yeah? I had to learn sex education from school. Man didn't learn that from man's mom. Man certainly didn't learn that from man's stepdad. No way. No way. The only time I think it's acceptable for parents to talk about sex with their children is in an educational way. Other than that, you should not be talking about no fantasies or nothing like that with your youth. And when I say youth, I don't mean just like 13 year olds. I mean, even like a 20 year old, 30 year old man. There's levels to this shit. I said, man didn't grow up like that where man could be talking about sex and that, like with, with man's parents and that. Listen, when I was a youth, yeah, even man's 13 years old, 14, probably even 16. If I'm in the room with my mum and we're watching a late night movie or whatever, 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 you know, we're sitting in the living room. If a sex scene comes on, Jelani, shut your ears and close your eyes. Literally, a man's like this, yeah. You know, they want their man trying to peek through the gap and that. Literally, if a sex scene comes on in the room with man's mum, when man was a, a teenager or whatever, innit? Jelani, shut your, shut your eyes. Shut your eyes, yeah? There's some parents, they, sex scenes and talking about sex is cool to talk about their youth with. Nah, nah. Even, even when the youth is even old enough to be having sex, there should be levels to this tape because what you're showing your youth is you're on the same level. You shouldn't be on the same level as your youth. You think man could talk about sex with my stepdad and no. I remember one time, even as a big man now, I would never even bring that conversation to me because there's levels to this thing. When remember back in the day, there was one channel called Channel U. Let me get rid of this. There was one channel called Channel U. It's now called Channel AKA, but man grew up on Channel U. One time I was watching Channel U in it. Now obviously Channel U used to have a lot of grime in it. Or obviously UK music only, but there's a lot of grime in it. But there was one guy who was a rapper. I don't think it was a grind video. I think it was a rap video. But during the grind era, but obviously there's certain man that used to do rap in it. Boom. There was one, I remember this video. I remember one day I was sitting down in the living room with my stepdad. I was listening to Channel U. Channel 360, 360. And one video came on. And the lyrics was, and the video had some gal in it. And the guy was like, yeah, baby, I want to see you shake your ass, shake your ass in front of me. And I said, I said, turn that off now. I had to turn over the channel. He said, I'm not sitting down with no teenager watching a video and a man's telling the girl, shake your ass in front of me. From that day, I knew, okay, I can't bring that conversation to my man. And that's how it's supposed to be. There's certain man now, even if a man's 50 years old, even if your child, your son is 25 years old, you shouldn't even be having no conversations with your son about sex with this girl or nothing like that. Yeah, if you're having a, you should be able to have a serious conversation like, Dad, I got this girl pregnant, blah, 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 blah. But other than that, a dad should not be having no conversations with his son in no joking, no loose conversation like, yeah, did you fuck her? And no, 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 no. No, there's levels to this thing. Man, a big man, 28, going to be 29 soon. I would not be talking that way with my stepdad. Nah, man was raised like that. Man was not raised like that. I ain't from some sort of suit society. Let's not get it twisted. Man didn't grow up rich. Man grew up poor and that. But bro, there were certain standards here in my yard that were set that didn't even need to be spoken about. Just one little, yeah, that, there weren't even no rules. Like, it was unwritten rules. Talking about sex with your parents. And yeah, if you want to talk about a situation like, oh, I got this girl pregnant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But other than that, there ain't no no conversations about, yeah, man, I've done this girl this way, I had a threesome. Are you talking to your dad about having threesomes with girl? I don't care if you're 25. I don't care how old you are. Your dad is not your brethren like that. Yeah, you could be best friends with your dad in, in a certain way, but there's levels to this shit. Like me... My mom's like my my mom is like almost like my best friend now. When I go there, I just literally go down to the ends. I want to link my mom, yeah, and I'll have a good conversation with my mom and that. But there's still levels to this thing. There's still levels to this shit. My mom is like man's best friend now, but there's still levels to this thing. Man, there's certain topics that will still get censored. That, like I said before, if I'm gonna swear in front of my mom, 
I'm still gone because if obviously there's certain times where you need to swear to you know tell a story and that, but man will still let her know that I'm conscious that she's in my presence, that I'm talking to my mum. So man will say the F word, but man will say you F, you understand, like man will let her know, okay, I still got respect for you, although I'm a big man and you understand, but I understand you're in the room and she gave me your ears is on the receiving end of this swear word. So there's there's no way. There's no way man could be having a mad conversation. I'm, I've, I've been around man with their dad and they're talking about sex and nah, I'm thinking, nah, I could never do this. And I don't even want to be doing it. Why don't I want to be talking about them things that were my parents for? So yeah, man didn't come from them households, man. Um, so yeah, the only time it's successful to talk about sex is when it's sex education and that. Uh, um, as I said before, when I was watching certain things on TV and that, and the sex scene start, Jelani, shut your eyes. <laughs> literally, literally, it's just like it was, it was like it happened yesterday, or it happened in that. My mom would say, Shut your eyes, straight, shut your eyes, and shut your ears. A man over there, yeah, you know, you know, that gap in between, yeah, man's all trying to, yeah. 